Trouble is mounting for HD Revanna. Revanna has been taken into custody by the special investigation team SIT. Move after court rejected the anticipatory bail plea. SIT has detained Prajwal's father, HD Revanna, remember? Charges against him also have been levied by several those who have come out and spoken about how the father-son duo sexually abused them. Sagai Raj is more, in fact has more details on that story, Sagai. This was but to happen. HD Ravanna has been under the scanner after the videos were essentially leaked. Son is absconding but father has now been arrested. Absolutely a big, big breaking news coming from Bengaluru. What we get to learn through our sources is that special investigative team have taken HD Ravana into custody. I repeat, JDS MLA, former minister, son of former prime minister and brother of former chief minister HD Kumar Swami, HD Ravana has been detained by special investigation team in the residence of HD Devek Goda near Padmanabhanagar. This comes minutes after the public representative court in Bengaluru had rejected, rejected the plea of uh, SD Ravana seeking for an anticipatory bail. I repeat, an anticipatory bail plea was being uh, uh, appealed against his arrest in the representative court of uh, Bengaluru, public representative court in Bengaluru, and it was rejected minutes after its rejection. The special investigation team had reached out Padmanabhanagar, the residence of former Prime Minister H.T. Deve Gowda. H.T. Revana was there in the residence and he was being detained in connection with the kidnap case. Remember, there are two FIRs registered against Ashni Revana. One, a sexual harassment case where he got an anticipatory bail, where uh, the, the, the public prosecutor mentioned that it was a bailable offence. But since that, uh, he, 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 he was quite free. But day after that particular, uh, 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 that particular relief, there was another case which was been registered where one of the young men had reached Mysuru police station in K.R. Nagar had registered a complaint of kidnapping his mother by an associate of H.D. Revana, Satish Babu. And subsequently, an FIR was being registered against H.D. Revana and Satish Babu. And he has also alleged that the videos which was being leaked, one of the videos where this mother has involved in sexual harassment. And after that particular video, she was being taken and she was being kidnapped and they didn't have any kind of information. And she was kidnapped on 29th and they didn't have any clue till May 2nd. They couldn't establish any kind of contact. And he had approached K.R. Nagar police station in Mysuru. He filed an FIR. And after that, uh, S.T. Ravana was uh, not, uh, not in public places and he was not visible in public places. And now, after his anticipatory plea, was rejected by a public representative court in Bengaluru. The special investigation team had reached off S.T. Deve Goda's residence in Padmanabhanagar and taken S.T. Revana into custody. The big question is, what next? What about Prajwal Revana is absconding? Given that the SIT has been formed specially to look into this case, what is it that is expected in the next few days vis-a-vis -vis Prajwal Revana? Okay. So next is the, especially the kidnap case because what we get to learn is that he, he got a big relief when it comes to the first FIR which was been registered that is of sexual harassment. In that particular case, it was bailable offence. Even uh, the public prosecutor said that it was bailable offence and uh, uh, the, he got a big relief after that. But few hours after that particular case, there was another case of kidnap where uh, uh, he has kidnapped one of the women probably a survivor whose video has gone viral and his face was, her face was visible and her son has filed a complaint saying that my mother video had gone viral and when they got to know they have taken her to Hassan and we didn't have established any kind of contact and it's been two days and in the complaint the son of the mother have alleged that her mother was raped by Prajwal Ravanna. I repeat he has alleged in the FIR, FIR copy that his mother was raped by tying her to the pole by Prajwal Revana. So the case was registered against Prajwal Revana and his associate uh, 
uh, uh, Satish Babu. Satish Babu was arrested, and today the the woman was rescued from Hassan, and interim bail was rejected subsequently in the public representative court, and he was been ar arrested in connection with the kidnap case in Mysuru. I repeat, he was been arrested in connection with the kidnap case where he has not cooperated. A couple of summons which was being uh, given to him was uh, not been entertained by them. They had not appeared in front of special investigation team, special investigation team, CID office. They have requested him. Their summon was being issued in Holy Narsipura residence. And he has also given an excuse saying that he had to attend public rallies in North Karnataka. And that is the reason he was unable to attend uh, the, the meeting. And what he also learned from the hearing which happened in the court, the stating that uh, uh, he has alleged that uh, he will not be able to attend until unless he get any kind of uh, protection. That means an anticipatory bail. Uh, the anticipatory bail plea was rejected by the public representative court, and subsequently, within minutes after that, uh, the SIT had reached out the residence of former Prime Minister Rishti Deve Goda in Padmanabhanagar and detained the former minister and sitting JDS MLA SD Revanna. All right, trouble mounting there clearly for SD Revanna, who has now been arrested by the SIT, by the police. Nagarjan Dwarkanath is also getting us more details. Father and son, in this case, their, un, their role under the radar as far as these very, very serious charges against them here is concerned. Naga, uh, HD Revana has now been arrested. What next is the big question here? Because there are several videos and the victims in this case, the survivors have spoken about Prajwal Revana, isn't it? case has to be seen in the largest perspective of the sex scandal mm -hmm. Most likely the SIT will produce Devanna this late night in front of the magistrate or early morning and seek custody of how much of the seven days is what we are told. It all depends on the man. So how many days will the custody be given? They feel that questioning needs to be done uh, about the complainant that says that his mother was kidnapped uh, and kept in a uh, guest house in Mysore. Now the victim has also been rescued from the kidnap case and she most likely will turn up as another victim in the sex scandal. Even though uh, Revanna has been arrested for the kidnap case, this whole case she seems to be seems to be looked in a large perspective where uh, the, the son has already said that uh, his mother was tied up as Ali, that his mother was tied up and was forced uh, by Prajwal Revanna is what he, the complainant has said. Now in the same case, uh, Revanna has been arrested. You know, also take us to the specific charges against H.D. Revanna, apart from the kidnapping case. Uh, in the specific case, he has been filed under one, IPC, one, three, IPC 364, which is a non-bailable uh, offence for kidnapping. What ha exactly happened uh, three, four days back, a complainant comes to Mysore, police, in Mysore district, Kairnagar police station, saying that his mother has been missing and he's got an information that He's been, she's been kidnapped because one of the close associates of Revanna came to the house and took his mother away saying, your videos have gone viral. Come with us. Revanna wants to speak to you. Uh, if you are at home, police will pick you up and that would be a bigger headache for us is what the complainant said. And in fact, later the complainant realized that he's seen his mother videos as well with Prajwal being where Prajwal was forcing himself on the mother. So considering she was a victim, the complainant alleges that Revanna kidnapped my mother and hence give justice. And two days later, uh, after the bail got rejected, Revanna has been arrested today uh, in the kidnap case. Because Prajwal Revanna is not in India, give us an idea about how things can move as far as the SIT is concerned. Uh, it is a clear-cut case and shut case for Prajwal Revanna because he's been booked for rape. There is no uh, uh, remedy for that as of now. There is no anticipatory bail also that unlike... All right, we'll just go back to Naga in a moment from now. But Naga was talking to us 